So first of all, let me introduce uh, my guest here, Steve Kozak from GE Capital. Thanks. So Steve, let's start with you telling us your job and what you're responsible sure. for. So um, basically I'm in charge of commercial information reporting for GE Capital Americas. And what that entails is really managing the CRM from the business side, the data warehouse, and driving the right information out of the systems in front of the right people, meaning the sales reps or the analysts. There's a few challenges we have. One is, you know, the CRM itself, the adoption of the CRM. For the last five years, or three years, we've had five Siebel instances trying to move down to one CRM, salesforce.com. So it's been viewed more or less as a management tool or a pipeline tool for senior leaders. It's usually, it's kind of a stick type of thing. Um, the other aspect is, you know, the challenge is people don't have, the, the sales reps don't have the skill, time, or the will to actually go into the internet, pull out the relevant information, right? They're busy, they should be out in front of customers. They don't have the time to do all that. The whole prep. concept is, how do we give back to them early and start changing the game? How do we go from you know, moving the needle and instead of using a stick on the CRM, you must go in the system, you must process deals to move to more like the whole, the whole carrot approach. What's in it for them? How do I become smarter? How do I drive business? How do I build relationships and make more money? There's another one, I think we all feel it is resource constraints, right? How do you do this with a small marketing team? How do you drive the best information through the right information, right person, right time with a limited staff and budget? And that's another key challenge. And you came up with this concept of your 360 degree account view. Right. So describe that, what, what it involves for you to have a 360 degree account view. Sure, so just what it sounds like 360 degree view. How do you take information in the marketplace about your customer and the customer's industry and the market they're in and create an environment where only the most relevant pieces of information come front and center to the sales rep. It's a full view of that customer from a, from a marketing intelligence perspective. First and foremost, the technology, right? There's a lot of players out there that deliver technology and solutions, but the first rain with the carousel and things like that, it was just very slick. Um, it's easy to maneuver. Again, it's all about an intuitive approach. We don't want to build this complex Ferrari. We want something that's very easy to use without any training. Pick it up. It draws you in, you go. So the technology is very good. Um, the other piece that you don't see a lot with other providers is um, the quality of the news and the focus of the news. So back to the comment about there's a lot of information on the internet. How do you sift through it? How do you not get the stuff that's not relevant to a sales rep or their customer? The engine in first train and the way it feeds data to our, our, our sales team is it's very filtered, it's, pres it's very prescriptive the quality of the news is right there. So you c combine the, the technology with the quality of news, you really have got a product that is gonna fit the bill and drive some ROI. So what's nice is the news and the way it's aggregated uh, can be completely aligned to our products and our industries and in the markets we serve. So that ability to also have marketing sit up as an admin and actually help the sales teams and prescribe the right news and the right filtering down is great and it also has the flexibility where the reps as we spoke about can customize it as well.